Welcome, I'm from the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 and today I'll show you how to enable the power saving mode. Now to get started, let's look for it in our notification panel with all the toggles and see if it's actually here. Now on the right is, so there is the power mode, you can tap on it and as you can see it will drop down to medium power saving. There is a couple different ways uh, or a couple different modes you can go through to save power. Uh, by default it, go, it goes to the, I would say, call it normal power saving mode. So as you can see in this mode uh, it will turn off always on display and limit the CPU to 70% along with uh, dropping the brightness or max brightness to uh, by 10%. So those are just the uh, kind of like the bare minimum and that will also save the battery by well, a minimum amount I would say. Um, so that is the normal one. Now if we go back to the toggle and actually hold it, I believe this will take us yep, to the actual options right here. And we have the um, more drastic power saving mode, the maximum power saving. And as you can see, uh, it does, well, apparently it does just the same thing as the previous one, uh, which isn't necessarily the case. It does way more. Mm, so let's tap on apply and you'll see. Now you have a list of everything that it does. So CPU always on display, restrict background data, limit number of usable apps, a dark mode, turn off uh, biometrics. So apparently you won't be able to use a fingerprint. Um, and as you can see, the phone will kind of look like this. Now, because this is a AMOLED display uh, or Super AMOLED, uh, the black areas of the display aren't actually being lit up. Basically, the pixels are turned off. So the phone virtually needs to uh, in terms of like lighting the display, light up anything that you can see on it. Uh, so that is basically the most maximum and drastic power saving mode that you can get and this will actually save the battery uh, substantially so you will probably get twice as much battery. I want to see if there is anything that I can see uh, but it, right here it only shows me the percentage, it doesn't actually show the uh, remaining time. Uh, but from different devices where I've seen uh, this kind of power saving does save a lot of the battery and would be most likely usable only in like really um, in the moments where you just don't have charger or probably won't have it for a couple days. Now this will basically prolong the life of your device from like one day normally to probably like three days. So once you're done with this mode you can simply leave it by pulling down the notification and tapping on the battery and then everything goes back to normal. And there we go. As you can see, we're now back in the normal mode with the power saving being disabled. So, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.